this way. We gotta go save the king. I have to go to the palace. I'm gonna go this way first. You have stuff to get. Is there anything in here we can use? Oh, well, it looks like there's a staff there. The spear. It's hers now. <laughs> it's pretty light and easy to use. Alright, let's go beat up some black mages. <laughs> oh, Vivi. Come on, you know I didn't mean you. I know. But, never mind. Somebody go give Vivi a hug. Zidon, give Vivi a hug. Didn't I just tell you to go give him a hug? He's not listening, guys. He's not listening to me. Ooh. Ooh. Mm. We want Reese's win. We want Reese's win for the next fight. Because it kind of makes things a lot easier. But we're gonna go in here first. Because here has Moogle. Have a letter. From Monkey to Atla. I heard Stitskin is headed in your direction, Koopo. I've never met him. Tell me what he's like if you meet him, Koopo. Check and see if he travels with the map of the entire world and with rare items like the rumor says, Koopo. Huh. Huh. That was really hard to say really fast. There's an exchange for the Gilberry. Yay! Sure, I'll take your letter. Um, we have a shop. We have a very good shop. Can I take one of those? I've got some in stock. Uh, ooh. Take the barboot. I need some more Phoenix Downs. Potions. Ah, uh, it should be good. Save in a minute. Equip. Let's see here. And we need some mag magic defense. Okay. Vivi's doing good. Let's give him some antibody. He's already got that one. Let's see, you need a bar boot? Oh, well, there's a dragon killer. Nope. Nope. Um, anything we can give to you that'd be better. Be nice, hat. There we go. And equip some more things. Alert. Antibody. Let's not give him auto potion for now. Dragon killer. And you have nothing to offer. Let's heal ourselves all up. Yeah, Zidane might have a little bit of racistness in him. Given that last cutscene, maybe just a, just just a smidge of racist, just a smidge. Saving again. We're already six hours into the game, and I still haven't uploaded any of this yet. <laughs> Yay, got stuff! But right, look who we have here. Hey, buddy, you wanna buy? What are you buying? What are you selling? Okay, we got a new thing for Vivi. Now what should we use? The thing that makes him more powerful, or the thing that gives him Thundara? Well... Uh... Uh... Ooh... E... Ah... Uh, ooh... Mm... Ah... Uh. Let's give him Thundara for a bit. As much as I like our new stuff, because it's powerful and amazing, Vivi needs... Thundara for this fight. That's a large statue. Jeez, this is terrible. Freya, I'm so so- I'm sorry, but from the looks of this, I don't think the king made it. I wonder if Dagger's alright. Now we're gonna talk to her. I don't know what to tell you. I could- we can only hope that the king and the others has escaped. Oh, poor Freya. I wonder if Dagger's alright. I don't think Dagger came here. I wonder where she went. Let's leave her alone. Vivi, let's go see what's over there. Let's give her a minute to, to deal with all this. <gasps> Gasp. Freya! There's someone inside the palace. What are you waiting for? Get off here! Freya's voice keeps changing. 
Make it sound so easy. We're not all dragon knights. <laughs> Come on. Um, okay. Oh, Vivi. I'm gonna go on ahead. Try to find a way up here. I'll meet you up top. I meet you inside after I eat food. I meet you after I eat food inside Palace. Okay. You have fun with that? Oh, can I have Zidane's jumping abilities, please? Or Freya's? Either one. Oh, hey! Who's that? It's Brawn. Oh, great, we get to pull up the Brawn voice. <clears throat> I knew she was behind all this. What do you mean you knew? I decided to return to Grameesha because I heard rumors that Brawn is such a sight on our kingdom. That girl standing next to her must be Beatrix, Alexandria's general. That's Beatrix? The cold-blooded knight who knows no mercy. Beatrix. Time for a flashback! Beatrix? Yes, Beatrix. I hear there are many fierce warriors out in the world, some even more powerful, some more powerful than even I. Beatrix of Alexandria, in particular. They say a swordsmanship is best in the world. Sir Fratley, do you insist on going on your journey? Yes. Please understand, Freya. Right now, Bermisha is at peace, while other nations are slowly but surely gaining power. I don't know if my spear alone will be enough to protect Bermisha. Which is precisely why I must go out into the world. Sir Fratley, I don't think I can live on my own, not without you. Freya, you're going to be fine. You're, you have trust your strength and have faith in your destiny. I'm being very bad at saying this. Then promise me one more time that you will return. I promise. Fratley, you never came back. You left me with nothing but rumors of your death. I couldn't believe it. I still won't believe it. Never. Not until I witness proof of your death with my own eyes. And I will travel across the world forever if I must. Poor Freya. Everyone has issues in this game. Are you alright? Yes. I was just thinking about the past. You still can't get over him, huh? Who's that? <gasps> guys, 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 guys! It's Kucha! <laughs> Hi. <clears throat> I find this rain quite pleasant. It feels as if the raindrops are blessing our victory. This is a great victory! No, oh, Crotic Hammer with Bronze voices! This is a great victory for us! Kucha, your black mage has made this conquest so simple! That's, that's Steiner's voice. My only concern now is finding the king of Kamisha. We must take care of him once and for all and prevent these rats from ever rising up again. Beatrix, what is taking me so long? I don't know, your majesty. I've ordered Zorn and Thorn to search the perimeter, but there have been no words so far. I will join them and lead the search right away. You're wasting your time. What? Rats often look for new homes and they sent an earthquake. Why is he British? They're probably moved to, to the sandy treehouse by now. So you see, it's too late. The king has already turned tail and fled. Sandy treehouse? Surely they don't mean Clara! It may be quite difficult if they escape to Clara. Clara. Unless we can get through that sandstorm, it will be impossible to attack them. Sneaky little rats! Kuja, what do you think? Surely with your powers, there must be something you can do! Of course, your majesty. I will present you with a marvelous display of my power. I am certain you'll be most pleased. I was wondering if you would gather your troops near Clara. I'm certain those filthy rats will retaliate in full force, and my black mages may not be enough. Kucha is such a creeper! It sounds like we got trouble. That sinister mon, who is he? Beats me, I'm nervous. Yes, you have. Well, it sounds like we're going to Clara. I've always wondered why the people call it the City of Illusion. I don't know either. Clara's remained in isolation for a hundred years. If my people escape to there, they'll be safe at least for a while. What's this place like? People from Clara are originally from Bermisha. Long ago, they severed ties with Bermisha, with Bermisha over a trivial conflict. Now the kingdom is at peace, shielded by a large sandstorm. What? You're boned! Look, there's someone else coming. What's he thinking? Jesus, gonna get killed! And then, of course, they run right in there to save them because they're protagonists, and that's what they do. Bermisha will never fall. Prepare to die. You wish to fight me, Beatrix of Alexandria. But Beatrix! I commend your courage, but I shall show you no mercy. 
No, we have to save him. Hold it. You have to deal with us first. But take care of this. Go find the king. Protect him with your life. Thank you, Freya. <laughs> I've never been so humiliated in my life. I once killed a hundred knights single-handedly. To me, you two are nothing more than insects. Well, time to fight, Beatrix. This is going to end swimmingly. Nice music, though. Hi, Beatrix. How are you doing? Um... Please don't murderate me. I wonder if I can use... I don't think I can, but I might as well try it. Let's see here. Let's use... I don't need to use this friend just yet. Um... Thundora! We've got our first Aura spells, guys. Get the Aura, then the Aga, then the Ultima. Steal. I am okay with that damage. Oh, oh, what? I, 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 that, I, 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 I forgot that she could do that stuff. Where's my phoenix down? Please tell me I have phoenix. There they are. That scared me for a second. I thought I didn't have any phoenix downs. Which would have been very, very bad. Dun, dun, dun. Reese's wind. Steal the stuff, Sidon. Be a good boy. And heal, healing, healing. Why didn't that heal me? I thought that was supposed to heal me. Oh, hi, Freya. Oh wait, it's Regan. Duh. Reese's win isn't a Reese's win isn't a heal, it's Regan. I'm not very smart today. Okay, Freya. Time for you to get up. Not dead yet. Come on, we gotta keep Freya alive. Freya does a lot of damage, so we want to keep her alive and not dead. Thank you, Zidong! Let's do another steal, just in case. Now, of course you couldn't steal anything. You're kind of a failure for a, uh, failure of a mage, and that hit for Bupkiss. That's weird. Might as well keep Phoebe alive anyway, because the last thing we need is to her to hit is for Beatrix to hit someone for 600 damage again. You're no match for me. Oh. Well then, I think the fight's over. <laughs> Ignorant fools. Well, she's a little fool of herself. Just, just wait for me to grind a little bit. I can still kick your ass. R how ridiculously weak. Is there anyone who is worthy of facing me? Come, Beatrix, you must prepare to attack Clara. Yes, your majesty. Now, what do we have here? Another filthy rat sense. Hmm. This boy can become a problem. Oh, Kuja. You're so silly. Now it's time for the cutscene of awesome music. And Kina is mysteriously missing. Wait for it. Oh, this music! Ah! Makes me so happy! Also, only wearing half a shirt. And also, Man Thong! If it wasn't for the fact that he was a mage, I'd say he probably has no protection around his groin area. I find it surprising that Kuja just didn't off them right there. 
I mean, they're obviously all still alive. You think if they'd have just killed them, then they would have wouldn't have had any opposition. Oh, right. Do you want to save your game? Yes, I do. Because guess what, guys? We've got to disc two. We got to disc two. Na 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 na. Change to disc two. Final Fantasy Nine. Now that is the point that I'm going to use to stop the recording for YouTube.